call anytime you need me and I'm gonna find And if you fall, I will be someone you can trust. I'm right behind you. And I'm on your side. And I want to see you fly. But you gotta make up your mind And don't you let another day pass you by You know what everyone, I just saw a sign And the sign asked the question, is your heart in it? And it made me think about Kobe Bryant, his beautiful daughter And all of the other people that was on that helicopter when it crashed And one thing that I can say about Kobe Bryant his heart was in it. And you know, over the years, he's had difficulties dealing with people. And people found it difficult to understand him. And it was simply because of what that sign just said. Is your heart in it? His heart was in it. A hundred, two hundred percent. And it makes me think about, are we truly living? Are we truly giving? Is it worth it? If you're not wearing your heart on your sleeve, if you don't know who you are, if you don't understand what you want to give. And so when I think about Kobe Bryant, I think about my heart being in it, and I think about how much being focused, thoughtful, committed, and in love with yourself, how important those things mean to an individual. And if you lack any of them, You'll have a subpar existence, but you'll also have a subpar life because the best version of you will not exist. So when I think about Kobe Bryant, I think about his heart being in it. I think about the fact that he showed all of us day in, day out. Don't worry about what people think. Worry about how you want to live. Look for the excellence in you and not the excellence in others. Yes, you can admire someone, but at the same time, chip away at the masterpiece that you intend to be. That's what Kobe showed us. And for all of the people around the world that want to honor him and continue his legacy, tell young people everywhere that you're not the best version of you, you're simply not living. Because people don't know and don't understand how masterful you have to be about loving yourself if you want to do some things in life that you would truly, truly, truly love. Now, I'm not a philosopher. I'm just an individual that lived a little while and I understand a few things. But I definitely know what having your heart in it means. So, Kobe, I'm going to continue your legacy by wearing my heart on my sleeve and making sure that every day that I wake up, my heart is in it. And I suggest all of you out there, find a way to analyze your heart, do an inventory, and ask yourself, is your heart in your relationship? Is your heart in it when it comes to loving your children? Is your heart in it on the job? Is your heart in it the moment you wake up? Is your heart in it? If it's not, find a way to get your heart connected and get in the game of life because the game of life is simply about you being you and not worrying about being somebody else kobe did one masterful thing he showed us that hard work will always lead to something great so remember finding out if your heart is in it is the beginning of you climbing that journey that mountain of life where you get to stand exactly where you need to stand because that's where you want to be. My name is JB The Mentor, and Kobe, I'm going to continue to honor you, and I'm going to continue to find my excellence in myself and make sure that I pass this on to my kids 
And everyone that's willing to listen to me, I'm going to tell them, are you focused? Ladies and gentlemen, as I always say, love yourself, love your community, be the change that you want to see. Please leave comments below and remember to hit that subscribe button right there in the middle so that when new content is released, you'll be the first ones to receive it. Loving yourself could never be a crime. It's the greatest act of love that you could commit to yourself. Don't wait for tomorrow Cause you ain't got that kind of time And baby, you were born to shine But you know There's no guarantee for tomorrow And promise me you'll hold on to All the life that still lies Deep inside of 